Hey guys, what's up? This is Brady from Jeep Renegade BU Instagram, Jeep BU AKA. Um, this is my 2017 Jeep Renegade Sport um, with a bunch of mods. Uh, let's check it out. All right, so this is Jeep BU in the flesh in the real life time right now. I don't know what time it is. So I'm gonna go with a list of upgrades I've done. Um, that's kind of not gonna go in order. Let's start, I'm gonna start with the wheels and tires. They're General Grabber ATXs 225. 7516s with uh, KMC 708s, 16 and a half by 7.5, I believe. I could be wrong. They are paired with a one inch wheel spacer, and these wheels have a 30 millimeter offset. Um, and so far, they've done pretty good. Um, I did have to do the pinch seam mob. Um, I kind of had to cut it down. I haven't really like heated up the fender liner and pushed it in yet. I kind of just cut it out. I have used new pre-owned fender liners i got a wrecking yard to put in there and make it all look nice um but yeah um 225 75 16 definitely uh gives it a little bit of a lift from factory um as far as suspension goes i'm running a daystar one and a half inch lift it's a puck lift paired with eibach pro lift kit springs um so far, the riding is awesome. Or riding, sorry, driving is awesome. Uh, you could definitely feel the bumps on the road, but off road is just phenomenal. It's pretty, it's pretty flipping amazing off road. Um, I only took it off road once with the e box springs. The other upgrades I have here, um, I have both front and rear Avid bumpers. This is the Radius rear, the one without the tire mount. The front is the Contour. Um, I was going to do the radius front just to ma match, but I didn't, didn't feel comfortable cutting, but I'm sure it's not that bad from other people I've seen do it on Jeep Instagrams and stuff. I also have the uh, Valkyrie off Valkyrie Off-Road 7-inch uh, Wrangler headlight adapters. These are also uh, um, pod lights from ATP. Those are those are pretty good. Um, everybody knows about those. And as far as the roof rack goes, um, I got Rhino Rack Arrow crossbars. Carrier basket on the top. Can't remember the specs on it. Um, I'll have to check that out online. I keep forgetting to do that because people ask, but I need to do that. Um, I got a Plano 42 inch gun case I use for my uh, fold up chairs and table. Since COVID-19, you can eat outside now. Um, I have the off-road tracks. Those aren't any, they're just a universal unnamed brand I got off eBay. Um, they're held in by uh, tie down strap. <laughs> I mean, zip ties, zip ties are your best friend, but I gotta figure something else out for that, but that's just temporary. The awning, the awning here, the awning is a four foot, I believe is the length. I, correct me if I'm wrong, um, ARB Touring. Used it over in Bend. Um, it's awesome. It folds out. Um, definitely good shade to have if you're out having a picnic on the trail or hanging out with friends. Um, these, uh, of course, I forgot to mention these. These are the Daystar Cam Cam mounts. They are all in all good. Um, I need to get stronger struts for the rear hatch because uh, in order for the rear hatch to stay up, you have to uh, take the cam cams off because it doesn't support the weight that well. But uh, yeah, all in all, it's. Um, um, it's been phenomenal. I want to do Valkyrie skid plate system and I want to do rock rails. I, as far as the four wheel drive system, it does pretty good. Trail Hawks have a low range gear. I could actually put this in four wheel drive lock and put it in first gear. It acts kind of like a Trail Hawk does. So, um, yeah, all in all, it's um, definitely been good. No issues whatsoever. Um, did have a CV axle replaced on the driver's side due to uh, installation of the struts that kind of nipped the boot, so it flew grease everywhere. But uh, all in all, um, everything's been uh, phenomenal. Everything's worked, um, no issues. Uh, I know some people have issues with these and I have not, so. Yeah, so um, thanks for uh, watching my YouTube video. This guy right here is definitely a fun thing to drive. Check me out on Instagram. Um, it's my, probably my second YouTube video, my really my only vlog video I have. So this is kind of be clips all cut, put together because I've messed up a bunch of times. So there's like a hundred clips on my phone. So um, hopefully you guys like it. Yeah, um, 
So uh, hopefully in the next year or so, I'm gonna have a change of scenery. Um, I'll be moving to Phoenix, Arizona in about a year. So um, this Oregon weather has been nice, but it's time for a change. And I think uh, Arizona is a good place to start. It's definitely hot down there. So if there's any Arizona renegade, hit me up on GPU Instagram. I'd love to head out, with, head out and explore the trails. Peace out.